Okay, here we have a function, 5x squared times sine x, and we want to find its derivative. So do notice that this is a product. So we're going to have to use the product rule. Now the product rule says when you take the derivative of the product, u times v, that's equal to u times the derivative of v with respect to x plus v times the derivative of u with respect to x. Okay, so in this particular case, f prime, the u is 5x squared and the v is sine x. Okay, so the derivative here will be 5x squared times the derivative of the sine x plus sine x times the derivative of the 5x squared. All right, so that's the product rule. Now let's go ahead and make those derivatives, calculate those derivatives. So the derivative of sine x is cosine x, and the derivative of 5x squared using the power rule is 10x. That's 2 times 5, reducing the power by 1. Okay, so we've taken the derivative. Now all that's left is to simplify a little bit. It looks like we have a GCF, so I'll go ahead and factor out the greatest common factor here, which looks like 5x. And what will be left is x cosine x plus um, 2 sine x. Give myself a little bit of room here. And that will be our derivative in its simplest form. Okay, here I'm at wolframalpha.com, and I wanted to check my answer really quick. So what I will do is just type in the derivative. That's what I want. The derivative of 5x squared times sine x. And then hit enter and see what it gives me. Okay, so ddx, that's Leibniz notation. The derivative of 5x squared sine x, that looks good. Typed it in right, is 5x. That was our GCF that we factored out times 2 sine x plus x cosine x. Looks great. Um, notice it also gives you a cool little picture. But there you have it. We verified our answer.